Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Warmer 40k in Crystal Tomatoes, wrong game again, sorry, to Sanctus Reach. And we have the last skirmish before we do the last story mission here. So let's get into it. I guess point wise it's going to be um, a bigger run as well. But let us see, well, how big it's actually going to be in the end. Come on, load up. So there you see, oh, it's quite point intensive. Asra Militarium forces hold the position in the west. The Orcs will attack from the east. The objective for both sides is to control the most victory points when the turn limit runs out. And as of usual, we don't have a knight, um, but we will go tank heavy, I tell you. Um, so, quite the tanks we have Ogrins alike, of course. And then we s take some hot shots. Hmm, the Primaris Psyker. How much is he now? He's too much. So, then let's go with the hot shots. Oh, Melter Guns. Alright, dig it, take it. And then some Flamers. And then we go into the mission. Um, I guess there are going to be plenty of orcs. That is going to be a little bit of a problem, I guess. But with our forces here, I think we can hold them at bay. At least I hope that the Vanquisher goes back, of course. I will put you right there and the Ogrins on this side. Oh, that's actually convenient that we have another Lemon Rust right here, which will guard this side. Hot shots move on. Goes there. You reinforce this side. And I'll put you right there. Alright, ending our turn. There was an amazing reaction fire there, actually. So, oh crap. There are many, many old orc boys. Please stay clumped up. That would have been just amazing. They would just have stayed like that. So I guess I moved our forces too far to the front there, but let us see, oh, if they stay like that, let's see how we can go through here in the next round. And I will just get at them right now, don't give them time to breathe. And we are going to land a shot right there, and another one right now, two squads, now one squad at least down. So you move up actually can you shoot any one of these guys yes there you can some shots to the side which is quite good and you are here to protect the Lehman Russ wow that I did not ex expect the sharpshooter thingy there nice all right these guys are just flamers I can't really move them on that's too bad so he moves up as well. Oh, there you see quite some forces actually. Please take down as many as you can. We don't want to have them burner boys right here. That grenade we throw anyhow. So can you? Ah, you would have sh have to shoot through cover. That's not nice. But what shall I do? Nice, both shots were in vain actually. And then... Can you crank out some kill shots please on the infantry? Or let us first of all try out something else. I'll move those guys right there or at least I will try that. Then crank some damage against those guys. Taking them out. 
Well, not nearly taking them out, but fair enough for now. Oh, you're the Melter guys. I didn't see that. And then you shall move on as well. And shoot. So these guys are down. What do we have left there? A burner boy, but he won't do anything off now. So we took out two squads there. That is quite good for us. So who do you shoot? Burner boys. And then I would like to shoot those guys. Even if I don't just destroy them. There we did some nice damage. You move on. So he's not down, but nearly. But we don't have any forces anymore to do something with, don't we? Alright, then give the turn up to the orcs and let's see what is happening right here. I think we can make it. Um, force size, I think it's on our side right now. If we just are able to kill those battle wagons, then that shall be actually quite fine, I think. And there you see the from the weird body bubble how much shots then are actually not hitting the enemy. That is quite astonishing, isn't it? So he killed his own burner boy, of course, that I like. Right, the war buggy had to move out of the way. In order not to get shot too too hard or to lose it this round. I still don't really understand the unit composition of the enemy. But I don't know. I'm still 100% sure, you know, the combination on going tank heavy is the right choice to do in this game. Because they just do so much damage are and they are not taken out easily by the enemy. Oh, this was good. Okay, he didn't hit nice. That is what I like. But, oh, 200 damage. Five. Can you believe that? 500 damage from the killer can there. That is just incredible. So it should be our turn any second. Yes. There we are. And, and still I am very, very confident. I don't see how we can lose this game for now at least. So then you focus on this. Oh, why don't I shoot the less cannon? That was a bad move on my side. So he then <coughs> moves right here and try to shoot him to pieces oh, which worked quite well actually then our artillery gun is going where's the money shot actually we hit three units here then so it may be so some are down you then move up as well try to give him the rest Try to give him a rest, like so. That is what we need there. And well, Renkushak is moving out then finally. And is oh, there was a shot. There were sh the shots we actually needed. If only the Melter guns will kill him off. Why can't they? Why can they only shoot one time? That is unfair. Alright, I do the only thing I should do here. So that was the right thing to do. So, stubborn. Incoming fire is nothing to concern yourself with guardsmen. Summon the guard, take the training manual very seriously. This unit has a high chance to ignore moral damage. Nope. Bionic legs. Shooting yourself in the foot will not get you out of physical training. You have been warned. Increase movement. And I think with them 
Ogrins, that is quite the thing to have. To be precise here. Alright. You can't fire them, but you can fire back. He did very much damage to you the last round, so... Give him something back. Alright. 81 damage, not too, too, too bad, but not the best as well. So, let's see what the orcs are going to do this round. I don't believe they are going to do too, too, too much, but let's, you know, find out right now. Alright, they are in the back. Two hits. Well, not bad. Okay, he got beefed up there. Nice. Well, not for us, but for him. But I think he should still be down a little bit. But I think it's quite nice that you see actually his brain. That is so cool. And the next turn I will take out the war buggy with our bionic Hogwarts, actually. That will be quite nice. Then, because I see, I think I know what they want to do. They want to go around on the right flank. At least I guess that for now. Oh, these are salt bikers I need to take out as soon. That is a little bit that surprised me now. Fun fact. Um, I don't hope um, that if we lose one of those, we lose. So that would be bad, but I don't think that that would be, that would be too unfair there. Alright, here, you take a shot there. Take another shot there. Some good damage. The, of course, he's engaged in close combat. Whatsoever. So, this guy's down. Then, are you still stuck? Yes, you are. So, who can you shoot? I guess that won't bring us anything right oh that was there were some lucky shots nice but I guess he's still stuck there all right at least he killed two units so you will then kill those guys and the war buggy can you reach him yes you can and did some damage vanquisher moves on as well can't shoot anyone and these guys move right here. I know I'm going to be shot at by everyone. But for now I'll take them shots. So if you could bring them down like so, that would be amazing. Thank you very much. And then that looks really, really good for us right now. So one buggy actually remains. I won't be able to take him out this round. Oh, maybe. That would be quite cool. Alright, down here is we have destroyed all our forces. And there we have victory. Oh, guys. Good, good, good. So, then, we are at the end of this episode. And the good part is that we, in the next episode, can actually go into the last mission of Warmer 40k Sanctus Reach. For now guys, I really thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this episode then please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I will see you in the next episode. Until then, have a nice day, stay frosty, bye.